Well, storms such as hurricanes, typhoons and tropical cyclones could become less frequent in a warming climate, but they could become more intense. But what does that mean for our storms here in Scotland? Well, there was a big rise in the number of severe storms that swept through the UK from around four in the winters of the 1960s on average to 14 in the 90s. Those of you who can remember the 90s, a very stormy period. But it was even stormier if we look all the way back in the 1920s when we had 16 per winter. So changes all over the place and no clear trend there. If we look at Stornoway, Lerwick and Kirkwall, in actual fact, since the stormy period of the 90s, there's been a very slight decline in the number of days with gales reported. So that does mean that changes in Scottish storms is more likely to be driven by natural fluctuations other than man-made factors. The one main change I think we'll see from storms here is coastal flooding could become more of an issue when we see them due to sea level rises. The fastest change in sea level has been seen in the last 30 years. And if we have a look at Aberdeen, well, there's actually been a rise of 80 millimetres in sea level since the 1930s. Now, 80 millimetres doesn't really sound like a lot, does it? But when we get passing storms, that will enhance the wave heights, the storm surges, which could more frequently end up breaching our sea defences and increase flooding and coastal areas.